Hello, Ballon Isles. Welcome to another edition of Happenings, keeping you in the loop of what's happening here in Ballon Isles. In case you missed last night's Country Club renovation workshop, a video of the presentation is available on the club's website and will soon be available on Channel 63 and our Ballon Isles YouTube channel. Also, stay tuned for an important message on the new resident directory, as well as a special thank you from the president of the Ballon Isles Charities Foundation for a record-breaking year of donations and support. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great week. We'll see you next time. Hi, I'm Fred Roy, telecommunications manager here on Ballon Isles with a very important message for the residents. Recently, an incident occurred when one of our homeowners was abruptly woken up in the middle of the night as a carbon monoxide detector alarm was going off. ADT called the home to notify anyone home to get out of the house immediately. ADT also notified the Palm Beach Gardens Fire Department, who arrived on the scene just minutes later and confirmed the toxic levels of the invisible gas carbon monoxide present inside the home. The carbon monoxide alarm went off due to the homeowner unknowingly not shutting off their car and was left running inside the garage. The carbon monoxide detector and ADT's quick response saved the lives of these residents. As you may or may not know, the ADT upgrade program that started in June 2015 is still available to you, our residents. If you have not opted to install some of the many life-saving devices and options offered by ADT, we strongly suggest you take another look as exclusive prices are available to the residents of Bound Isles. If you have any questions, want to make an appointment, or would like to have carbon monoxide alarms installed in your home, please contact the ADT call center. Thanks for your attention to this very important matter. As you know, the Ballon Isles Charities Foundation has just completed its sixth annual fundraising event series. I want to thank all of you for your overwhelming support of our mission of making a difference to local nonprofit and civic organizations that serve so many children and families in need. This year, because of you, we will be awarding grants of $500,000 to 42 organizations. That's a six-year total of $1,765,000. That's truly making a difference. Besides your financial support and that of our corporate sponsors, this could not have been accomplished without the dedication of our hardworking volunteers, the management and staff of the Country Club and the Community Association. I am proud to have worked with the talented Board of Directors and thank the chairs of our standing committees for their tireless dedication and efforts in attaining these results. On Tuesday, February 28th, we will be handing out a half a million dollars of checks at our awards ceremony. Please join us for this heartwarming event and meet the organizations that are benefiting from your donations. Thank you again for making a difference. Hello everyone. The time is near when the long anticipated resident directories will be distributed. Due to some changes in the printing process, the distribution of the directory has been delayed, but it is coming. So look for an email later this month when the distribution dates will be announced. We thank you for your patience and understanding and know that you will enjoy the new results. We've organized the uh, Bound Owls uh, Survivor to um, help promote fitness here at Bound Owls as well as to help support the Bound Owls Charity Organization as well as uh, Life Fitness for supporting us, sponsoring us as well. And we just hope to have a good time and may the best team win. Okay team, let's get into position. Hi, I'm uh, Richard Myers, Chair for Development for the Ballon Isles Charities Foundation. I'm so proud to be able to participate in this outstanding uh, uh, portion of the uh, Charities Foundation events. Just want to say uh, thank you on behalf of the winning team for the Ballon Isles Survivor Charities Foundation fundraiser. Purple team rocked! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. <laughs>